Welcome to Luxuriously Poor, and thank you guys for stopping by. Today I'm going to give you a really helpful recipe, you know, really good for you. But I'm going to give you some really good tips on how to preserve your vegetables so they will last you longer and it won't cost you as much money. So stay tuned. Now here I have, it's only a couple of pieces of broccoli. I get my broccoli frozen from Costco and it's organic. And it's just a couple of pieces, but I'm going to chop it into very small pieces. Now, these are purple potatoes. They're very tiny potatoes. Um, they have them at Sprouts here. I haven't really found them very often. It's very rare that I can find them. And I'm going to chop them up into small pieces. They taste just like a potato. Exactly. If you don't have them, you can use whatever potato you have, red. I don't buy russets anymore. They're not worth their money. They're disgusting, rotted, hard. I just find them unedible. So I usually buy red, but I ran across the purple and I bought these. I've got a couple of mushrooms here. I'm going to chop them up in very small pieces also. You see, I've got everything chopped up. It's done in very small pieces. It really is. And then what I'm going to do is take all of this and I am going to put it in. A, it's a small skillet. It looks like a lot, but it's really not. But it could feed two people easily. At least I think so. I put two tablespoons of olive oil in this pan. Nothing else. No spices. Nothing. A little bit of salt. That's it. Whoops. <laughs> I got a big piece of broccoli in here. I guess I missed that and didn't cut it up small. But that's okay. I'm going to go back, cut it up, and I'll throw it back in this skillet. Because I'm going to cover this and kind of let it steam um, in its own liquid. Because I'm going to turn the burner down really low. Sorry that it looks so dark. My kitchen has a dark. Sometimes it just does. But here it is now. I put an egg in the middle of that when I took the egg out. I put the egg first into the plate. And then I scooped all the vegetables around it and on top of it. And that white stuff you see chopped up there is fresh garlic. This is an awesome, healthy, and inflammatory uh how do i say it preventive uh measure that you can help with if you've got problems with your joints this is a great breakfast to fight against inflammatory great dinner who says you can't have eggs for dinner with all these vegetables <laughs>